All right, here's a really fun way to help feed the homeless this holiday season. Hope of the Valley Rescue Mission is hosting its first ever drumstick dash on Thanksgiving morning. It's going to be right here in our CBS studio lot. And CEO Ken Kraft is here to tell us all about that. Welcome, Ken. Welcome. Good to be here. So I love this idea that before we sit down and sort of eat everything in sight, we can actually get in a little exercise and help the homeless here in our community. Yeah, it's been estimated the average person will consume 4,000 calories on a Thanksgiving oh, I day. It. I and so, what we're it. doing is we're providing an alternative. People can come, they can exercise, and while they're exercising, they'll be helping the homeless and the poor here in Los Angeles. And when we talk about this drumstick dash, it's, it's not just a run, it's for anybody and uh, so many activities going around the event. Yes, it's for the whole family. You have those that really want to compete, their race starts at 8 a.m. You have those that just want to complete. A 5K. Their race starts at 9 a.m. and then the little kids will be chasing after a turkey at 10 a.m. It'll a, all be done by 10:30. Uh, a person in a costume. Oh, okay. <laughs> 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 so th this is a great way to really get the family out of bed, get them together, get out and get some exercise and fresh air on Thanksgiving Day. And, and realize that there are people in our community that really do need our help. And the need is so great this year. We're all talking about El Nino. Mm -hmm. And I know that you provide shelter all year round and services all year round. But it seems like that the need is going to be a lot greater this year. Yeah, we recently just opened up a 100-bed shelter in Pacoima, another 120-bed shelter in Silmar, and a day shelter in Van Nuys. Homelessness has increased 12% over the last two years. And so by doing activities such as this, it gives the community an opportunity to get involved and to make a difference. And so we're encouraging people to come on out and move their feet so others can eat. And, and in fact, the, the great thing about LA is you've had such a tremendous response to your Thanksgiving feast that you provide to the homeless that you sort of created this dash because there were so many volunteers. Yeah, on Thanksgiving Day, we tend to have uh, five, six, sometimes 700 people who want to volunteer to serve the homeless, but we can't facilitate that. So we only need about 400. So the rest of them we now are saying, come join us on the Thanksgiving morning and uh, let's use this opportunity to provide food, shelter, clothing, and care for the homeless year round. But let's make it happen on Thanksgiving morning. I'm looking at this picture. This is so impressive. This is last year's feast. What is this day like for the homeless people who actually get to receive some of the bounty? It's amazing. We bus them in from all over the San Fernando Valley. That's why it really is one of the largest ones uh, in L.A. We bus them in, and they are just taken back because not only is it a meal that we give them, but we have a resource fair. We give them underwear. We give them socks. We give them haircuts. Uh, we give them um, you know, gloves, hats, everything that they need. It's a resource fair uh, for the homeless as well as a great meal uh, that they're sure to enjoy. Enjoy. Yeah, and a little bit of the holiday spirit to carry with them. Ken, thanks for being here. Thanks for everything. All right, the Drumstick Dash, it is coming up Thanksgiving morning. It's on the back lot of the CBS studios right here in Studio City. The first race starts at 8 o'clock in the morning. For more information on how to participate, just go to kcal9.com and you can click Seen on TV. Thank you.